From Choctaw Resort in Durant, Oklahoma, this is Poker Night in America. Hello and welcome to Poker Night in America from Choctaw Resort in Durant, Oklahoma. I am Chris Hansen. This guy's name, Joe Stapleton. Thank you, Chris. Coming up on today's show, a local lady shows the pros what's up and Gavin Smith and Brandon Cantu debate setting up a fight club for toddlers. Some small buy-ins here today. Nobody going too crazy. Esther Taylor Brady with 10,500, the biggest buy-in. I like the buy-in of 5,600, a nice <laughs> even number. Are we playing now? This is official? This hand counts? I don't understand this why am I big? Did money. we you drop a bunny? Yeah. yeah, they did a bunny. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta be out of here by five o'clock. They gotta set up for Billy Joel later. Good luck, people. Good luck. Remember, I have small children, so. Let's have some fun today. Don't try to mess me up too bad. And welcome back, Gavin Smith, to Poker great. Night in America. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. No, it's not great. How, How small are the children? Four and five. Okay. Oh, wow, that's cool. Good for you. Gavin, I think my kids can beat your kids up. No chance. Yeah, I think they can. Oh, no, no <laughs> chance. I, I would bet my five-year-old can take my five My oldest, yeah. my, my five-year-old If he's five, I know my ass. Ass. There's no way. It, it would kick your kids Let's do it. Let's set it up. It'll this be, hardly it'll sounds be, legal. Like, no, I don't like where this is going at all. Okay. Okay. We can bet on. I just don't too. think. I just don't think your five-year-old can take. And it. I'll tell you one thing: if your five-year-old beats up my five-year-old, I'm gonna beat up you. Four. I don't think you can beat me up <laughs> Alec, either, Gavin. Fifty. I have bad news for you, Alec. Uh, oh yeah. Daphne Turner won her seat here by logging so many hours of live play. We beating up children right off the right out of the gate, guys. Yeah. We do. Okay. And, and Cantu, I can definitely beat you up. Oh, for sure. I could beat up Cantu. Well, I couldn't beat you up, so that, yeah. that, that's not really. Ethan, what do you set the line at that between them two? <laughs> I don't know. We may, we might need to have to find out. What's the over under on what grade you stop talking about who could beat who up? How many drinks does Gavin have in him first? <laughs> That's I set the line at right? halfway through your sixth grade year. It's a good line. Fives. Wow, cold blooded. Turner gets there on the end. More like River. Yeah. Am I right? Yeah, so then Turner. Fives. Nice hand. Do you ever get tired of having all the money? <laughs> Let's get into the nitty gritty. Winning every single game. How long did you live in Macau? Three and a half years. Just cash. Well, it seems like we've covered the whole I've lived in Macau thing with yeah. Alec Torelli Sometimes before. No. Sometimes you just I like Macau. session just to see what I like Macau like. a lot. It's kind of a burden to have that much money you know, and win that many times. <laughs> I'll take that burden any day. <laughs> I think there's plenty of people that have more money. I just wing it. No. 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 Nobody. <laughs> Nobody. Where did you, where'd you no. live when you were there? Did you, uh, did you get a house? One cent from the wind. Okay. You know, or the, you know the wind, obviously. Yeah. So the tower across from the wind. Okay. It's connected to the MGM and the Mandarin. Yeah. It's the only place to live, really, yeah. if you want to play poker. We actually wanted to live at a different building, mm -hmm. but the games are like so, like, you, you have to like get to the wind Be so close. fast. Yeah. Yeah. That like, you know, there were days where like I was sprinting to the win, and sure. if I was two minutes later, I would have missed a game that right. was like Huge. my rent for the year, you yeah. know? Like, so I just can't, yeah, you just can't afford to live You need to be right there. What, yeah. uh, what is your monthly rent? Stapes, you played a lot uh, of those I mean, games I don't have right now, but my Charlie, monthly rent in Macau. Uh, I have not played in a lot of those games. I was in Macau sometimes once and didn't come within a country mile of them. Well, like sometimes there's the big games. games. Also, really flops right. of boats. Soft fields back then. Yeah. When did you live there? 2012. You just got raised. I, I got there January 2012. Don't be moving in on my girl, Hanson. Is he talking to you? No, he's talking to my twin brother Tad. Oh, Tad is yeah, out there. Tad's again. back again. Tad is such a creep I like too. That question. And then he interacts yeah. with the cable and it ruins everything. Stupid, stupid, get out of here, Tad. Se buttono via. Se già partenza. Don't be speaking any more Spanish at the table. It's Italian, but no, it's obviously. <laughs> Call. Call. Mm. 
Oh, Cantu is waiting on the 7-3. <laughs> Cantu has a 10. He has 7 plus 3. Oops. Oops. Just Oops. outkicked by the 8. I was just checking his heart, that's all. by the 8. <laughs> this is the only way Cantu can lose a pot is if he gets it in debt. If he had any equity whatsoever, he would have gotten it. I'm not positive. But I, I, don't <laughs> think, I don't think that was the best what, play what, ever. what happened? After the break, we'll see if any two Cantu does, in fact, continue being dealt two cards. I would hope so. More poker night in America when we come back. For more from Poker Night, visit PokerNight.com or find us on Twitch, Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube, where you can see complete episodes and unedited live streams. Welcome back to Poker Night in America at Choctaw Resort. We're going to do a little experiment. Coming up in this segment, we deal Brandon Cantu the deuce of diamonds and the rules for playing poker. And then we're going to see if he manages to play them. Just kidding, we're not going to do that. You know that Ite wouldn't even know what a deck of cards looks like if it wasn't for me? She wouldn't Take even... Take a needle, MFR just said she has your chips now. <laughs> <laughs> I could afford to pay that river off because Cantu just put it in debt against me. Yeah. Well, he was, yeah. I'm so proud right now. <laughs> That's why I said, if you, if you have heart, you're never upset. You know who's no, got to have way more heart than even Cantu is Cantu's wife. Can you imagine him watching him play? <laughs> <laughs> she can't even watch. She's at home on the camera like, oh my god. Oh, oh my god, did he really doing? do that? She's in the tank, she's like, don't do she it! Sees the, she sees the little equity thing that says 100%. Oh, yeah. Oh, she's like, no! <laughs> no. I don't get it, why is he putting all his money in? <laughs> Zero. I thought you were supposed to have more than Seven's well, not a good well, card. Well, the, the worst would be she's watching it and as he's thinking. And she's going, not again, Cantu. Please, <laughs> please, Brandon. This time, just fold. Matt Russell called the raise. Brandon Cantu has a decision to make on the straddle. B can. Thirteen hundred. Cantu makes it thirteen hundred. Back to Taylor Brady. He raises it up to 2250. Russell, even though he doubled up, doesn't have a ton of chips. 2150. This is all interfold territory for Russell. He is right, choosing the latter. Well, oh, you're all in. Cantu's live. <laughs> Damn it, I should have called. Like He's got even more hurt. Oh, are you calling? Wait, did you say all in? Yeah. He said I, he oh, said well. I called. He said I called. How much call? more? <laughs> how much more? 400 more. Oh. I, I, want, I need said, to know how much more, I'm obviously. Sure wow, now she's needling me down. I just wanted to make sure I got paid in full, you know? <laughs> yeah, I, I need to know how much more. I mean. I had nines. I love right. when they needle me and I have a good chance. Oh, wow, you were, you were. Man, can't you spending too much time with Helmuth? Yeah, He's starting to sure, sound yeah. like How him. Much? For sure. 2650 total. I feel as though the 10 deuce is going to win this one. one. I do too. It's <laughs> funny. I... 400 more? 400 more. I like it when the I like it when there's an arrogant yeah. player oh, against true. me at the table. <laughs> if there's anyone who can do this, it is can too. I have to go all in. When it comes like deuce, deuce, deuce. I did it in Doyle, you know? Hoping she doesn't have an overpair. And hoping he's, you know, yeah. You, yeah. I mean, I like it if she folds. I don't even, I don't even see how you, sure. I like it if she folds. You're just running really bad. If you get dealt the 10 deuce, I mean, how can you not lose 3,000? Uh, That's Oof. a lot for me. Things get very difficult now for Cantu. Sir. They sure do. Eight. Oh. Eight. He's not drawing dead. I win. I win. Yeah, you Son win. Son of a yeah. Pocket nines Keep would on. have been the winner there. That was you bad luck. You win a lot if he Brandon. folds. That was very That's unlucky. sick. Alex, you're supposed would you to consider that bad luck for Brandon? Yeah. 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 Well, he's, you you're, you're, you, you, you ran you so well that hand, he's supposed to stack you. Yeah. He's supposed to fold, and he's supposed to call the flop and then stack you. You. Alec, can you let me have my moment? I right. That's true. He doesn't need to drink. He actually doesn't need to drink. What do you, come up, what do you, what do you guys want me to do? Why don't you come up with your own material? Yeah, I mean. Yeah, that's Gavin's yeah. term. It's what Gavin's the line. heck? Well, I, Speaking of material, I think Gavin took a prop bet where he's supposed to do stand-up yes. comedy at some point this year. Nobody objects. I haven't. Because he's always sending me bits on Facebook. What do you think of this bit, Maybe Stapes? As if I, I am the expert. 
Is most of his comedy now since he lives in Alaska moose based? <laughs> there, there's a couple of moose gags in there. I don't know how well that plays to the continental United States. Look, we've all woken up with a moose in our kitchen from time to time. Not in the frying pan. <laughs> Up and down draw for can two. Torelli with pocket kings. Ugh. You didn't play the tournament? No. Did I already ask you that? Oh, Torelli no. calls the bet. We go to the turn. What do you, what's your plan for World Stop this year? I, it's undetermined so far. Can't do, oh, okay. uh, still semi-bluffing. be there for some of it. Okay. Not as much as in, in the past. Yeah, us either. We're not. We're not gonna do like full, full meal deal. Eleven hundred. This number used to kill me staying out there for a while. Yeah, it's so long. Call. Serious. Call from Torelli. Long. If I make a bet, it's going to be all in. All in. All in. Go straight. And a call. Oh, boy, that happened so fast, we didn't have time to commentate over it. The magic of Cantu. Mm-hmm. 35.50? They never believed me, Gavin. Well, I think you've earned that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you do have the nickname of any two Cantu, yeah, very good, very good point. I was kind people of will know that you will play any two around, cards. Yeah. It's actually a misconception. People think it means any two cards, but it means any hand with a deuce in it. It's just all just too easy. I'm a stickler for details. Well, yeah, that's it. that's being observant. Well, how about these two hands that are facing off? Can't do it. Kings Torelli, Torelli with yeah. jacks. We just saw Cantu double through Torelli. Do you know Will the blogger? Not jamming this. Oh. I, I should have known that. <laughs> do, you know, do you know that he always wears these kind of pants? And it's actually kind of scary to have to look at all the Yeah, pants. I don't like those pants at all. <laughs> Gavin, you would not wear those pants? I would not wear those You would pants. not participate in those pants? No. no. <laughs> I'm going to have to join Gavin and agree that I would not wear those pants either. I mean, he, he has them lined up in his closet <laughs> by color. <laughs> by color and how tight they go around the ankle. When you introduce him, do you call, always call him Will the Blogger or sometimes yes. you just call him Will? Always Will the Blogger. That's his name. All right. You have to call him Will the Blogger from now on. Well, you're from now on Will the Blogger. It's a good thing she said that though because I'd already forgotten your name. <laughs> 46. I'm all in. King's a 78% favorite. I got him. Oh I call. God. I got it. Go ahead. Hold on one second, dealer. Yeah. Oh, you want me oh we don't have to yeah. flip over? Sorry, I don't yeah. know. Well, you have to, because yeah. I called. We do. For the show, yeah. Oh. We, yeah, yeah. That's fine. And that is going to make it really, really difficult for Jax to win. My goodness. Cantu spent the first half of his day doling out the chips, and now he's just been exacting his revenge. They can't fool jacks against me, Gavin. Like Liam Neeson's oh, special again. kind of skills revenge <laughs> he's been pulling out here. We've got more tight pants and tight plays after the break. What's it like to have 100 million? I don't have 100 million. Okay, at the yeah. peak of all peaks, yeah. I was listening to it. What's it like? It's really good. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Poker Night in America. Come on, dude, let's play some poker. How many you got in your Twitter, Gavin? 31. Put a different picture on that. It is old. Jeez, on Twitter. That's fine. Well, that's because I went from being old to being old. I personally never thought Gavin was going to make it this it far. Happens. It'll happen to you, too. It'll happen to you, too, one day, Cantu. You will not be young forever. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I don't believe Cool it. story, bro. <laughs> You don't think I'll always be like a young gun? Brandon, we actually got Gavin friends? Smith set up with a new Twitter account this week while he was here at Choctaw yeah, well, because somebody see, took to control of his old account and he couldn't get it back. Oh, Gavin, that's what you get for making right. your password one, two, three, four, five. No, it wasn't. It was one, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> they never go the extra distance. No, they don't. See, well, your first instinct was only to five. He said it was up to six. Your phone work. Okay. I don't know. Is that mine or? No. The reason Brandon Cantu, Kings again. Just cool. 
I call shenanigans on that. But this time, Himmelbrand doesn't have anything like to, get, see the stats. to go against the Kings. Just Ace Jack. How many hands can to his... <laughs> he spent 700 in the dark. And we thought he needed Greyhound to block. <laughs> uh -huh. We thought this... Idiota. Well, now he's got draws up the wazoo. One with him in his what? Way? A heart, a three, an ace. But I don't know what it was. It's one, it's I'll do one of those, too. No, it's the one of you and your wife. Don't do that. I don't want it. 1,700. Yeah, yeah. No, I got a good picture. I'm using this one. Again, again, we're onto this issue of yeah, I, Hanson button in. That's true. I actually forgot about that. Tad Hanson, get oh. out of there. I know, I know. That's I'm going to talk to my mom about it. She'll square him away. All in and a call. No. Himmelbrand all in over the top of Cantu's bet. <laughs> it's got about 38% equity. Oh, come Gets on. there. Come on, how do they do that to me? Greg was gambling a little there. Yeah, I'm gambling. What do you think I'm here to sit around and fold? Okay, camera guys, you might as well shut it down and take a break for a couple minutes here while Cantu's gone. They have names, <laughs> Gavin. <laughs> Nothing's gonna really happen. Don't ask me what they are. Why don't you take time at a restroom Wait. break? For real. Well, you do know they have names. I know they have names. Why don't you go to the restroom if you need to go? Oh. I'm sure there's a Larry there somewhere. That right there, that's the table. Uh, that one guy. Mm -hmm. I think it's Steve? Oh, he's a Steve. Yeah, there's a Steve in there. We're delayed anyways, like 20, 30 minutes. I mean, I don't care, obviously. It's, it's just better than other people leave, you know? 6.50. Himmelbrand follows that big win up with queens. 650 total. We saw Russell fold nines before. I don't think he'll be doing the same thing with tens, and that is going to cost him, more than likely. Get in here for a selfie for that. <laughs> Heads up with Greg and Matt. Oh, wait. Set of tens <laughs> for Matt Russell. Wow. And that is not going to cost him. Looks like Russell's going for a raise. I'll allow it. It's a pretty draw heavy board. Raise. It's going to hit Himmelbrand's range quite a bit. 3,500. Raise to 35. All in. All in. Call. Call. Mm. You do always have the tens, this is true. I know, <laughs> it's like scary. Listen. Yeesh. Thank you. Thank you. Not so sure about the way that hand went down. It escalated very quickly. Tens again. Oh, and you stuck it to Greg. Brandon said nothing's gonna happen. You stuck it to Greg. Brandon goes away and all hell breaks loose. He's very reactionary. All in call. But I'd like to see a little more thought go into it. That would make you low in the rankings, right? If you know they got it. You can't beat it, what and you call it. Where does that go? That's not a great. That would be a bad ranking. Play. Yeah, that. I, I, seven. I, know I called it. <laughs> I knew I had a freaking seven. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that would be. That's a really I bad. Think it, I think You're right. That was, that, was that was an absolute. That's the Greyhound. I think in the. That was an absolute. I think on the on the uh, Alex Torelli yeah. scale of ranking yeah. poker players, that would really like negative two. Turner makes a 150 with jacks. Oh boy. Guys too. Don't, Gavin, don't. She's so nice. Don't do this to her. She got in through a drawing for logging hours playing cash here at Choctaw. And Gavin Smith is going to do her cooler style with kings over jacks. I enjoy it. We got a little suited connector action here, which might get in the fold. Oh, Gavin. Old. We'll just be heads up with Turner and Smith. The sequel to Turner and Hooch. Yeah, what a guy. Makes 1,400. Gavin just slobbers just a little bit more. He was like really pissed off at Gavin. Yeah. Pretty bad flop too for Jax. At least when it comes to ace, king, queen, you can get away from it. Okay. 
call. Folds it. So hard to fold an over pair. Just holding on. Trying to win at showdown. Chips off the table. Yeah, I have like maybe three came up. Hey, look at that! And then that happens. Go ahead, bet again, Gavin. And that took him from my pocket and put him in a stack. So yeah, I remember you went in like a 20k pot. Raise, raise, raise. Oh, she just calls. Now I feel bad for Gavin. Now yeah, wait a second, I do too. Why does somebody always have to lose? Gavin was really playing straightforward. He was playing, you know, bigger pairs. He was just really straightforward. So when a jack hit the river, I knew then I'm like, oh, good. I'm glad I, you know, hit that because I know I need. I knew I needed it, but I was just willing to see it through. Daphne Turner is doing well. Find out how well coming up after the break. Chip count alert. Closed captioning is brought to you as a public service by Poker Night in America. Hey, thanks for coming back to Poker Night in America. Let's see who's got the money. The biggest winner so far is Brandon Cantu, but Daphne Turner in seat two, making the most of her chance on Poker Night in America. And there's something you don't see very often, a big red arrow next to Alec Torelli's name. The good news is that's like three big blinds in Macau. In summary, Cantu found some cards. And our friend Daphne beat up some pros. Next time, Phil Helmuth brings a rich friend and no ladies, he isn't single, God. For more from Poker Night, it's real easy. Get online to PokerNight.com or you can find us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and Twitch for up-to-date information, unedited live streams, and complete episodes. For Joe Stapleton, I'm Chris Hansen. We'll see you next time on Poker Night in America. Wait, wait, how many, how many pounds is your five-year-old? Oh my God. Is there really like a big weight difference in five-year-olds? Look, look how big Gavin is. I mean, sometimes I mean, there is, I guess, but geez. five well, years no, old. So like, like, it could be like, maybe he's like, is he like really tall? No, he's like 42 inches tall. Oh, I think, I think mine's got the height advantage. <laughs>